This tutorial will show you how to edit a controller within a customer and site in the Paxton Blue cloud-based access control system. I've logged in as my dealer account and I can see the list of customers associated. I can now click on the sites icon and see all the sites that are associated to this customer. Now that I see the list of sites, I can click on the controllers associated to that site and it will give me a list of each of those controllers. Should I wish to edit the settings associated to one of those, simply click on the controller icon and it will take you into those details. In the top left corner, if you click on edit, it will allow you to see the details and change certain parameters such as the name or notes associated to that controller. I can return to the controller details page and I can do things like adjust the settings whether this is using the site settings or individual settings for fire alarm integration. I can set time or get the local time associated to this controller. Should I need to, if this controller needed to be replaced for any reason, I have the function here to replace that controller. By returning to the top left corner and the Paxton Blue icon and drill back into the sites and then controllers. If needed to, there's a delete icon here where I could delete the controller if I was no longer going to be using it on site. For more information and tutorial videos, please visit the help section of the Paxton Blue website, my.paxton-blue.com. As always, our world-class support team are here to support you. You can reach them by phone at 800-672-7298 or by email at supportus at paxton-access.com.